with fire I purify, the souls I extinguish. Halloween infests Marvel's Avengers. Doctor Strange senses a mysterious evil seeping into our realm. Casting spells to reinforce our reality's defenses, he opens a portal from the Sanctum Sanctorum to the Helicarrier. Moon Knight ventures through the portal and relays Doctor Strange's grave warning, enlisting the aid of Earth's mightiest heroes. From a new hub in Hell's Kitchen, you will assist the defenders in executing this haunting threat with extreme prejudice. With a bit of investigation, you'll find defender reputation to be earned from Jessica Jones. And for a limited time, Marvel zombie nameplates, emotes, and skins to unlock. Daredevil, Ghost Rider, Blade, Punisher, and the immortal Iron Fist may not be joining the Avengers roster, but are eager to accompany you as companions in Hell's Kitchen missions. Progress through this mission chain and help the Sorcerer Supreme vanquish this Avengers level threat. And just maybe, he can be convinced to join us. My name's Kyle, and this is the game that Marvel's Avengers will never be. Avengers released so buggy and broken that over a month after release, the developers admit the game is not in an acceptable enough state for the DLC that they have pushed back. Even after patches fixing quote, thousands of issues, Avengers falls woefully short of the $60 asking price and wastes its Marvel license with only two villains, one enemy type, and zero Marvel locations. A fact that won't be changing for a minimum of three months following launch as AIM, the robot enemy type, are shown to be the focus of the next two big DLCs that revolve around two archers. So. A Marvel Live service with one enemy type for its first three months, a superhero game that bizarrely chose two archers as its first DLC heroes, a Marvel property with only two villains and no locations when comic and MCU fans are so familiar with many, made even more bizarre because MODOK, a villain that was created and exists in the single player version of the game, is not available post game and the single player cannot be replayed. Ice that cake with game crippling bugs, crashes, progress wipes, bad loot, and Crystal Dynamics showcasing the least appealing cosmetic shop in any Marvel game because of an apparent allergy to MCU and comic book skins, and you're left with a release playing catch up to every other experience in the industry at a pace so slow that you can't help but wonder if they're like two people staffing Crystal Dynamics. Instead of these, you get this. 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 Instead of a patrol mode where you can land solo, run into real players on their hero of choice and tackle public events and fight respawning enemies for loot, or a flight mode for only flying heroes with chases, obstacles, and aerial combat, or even a payload mode where you can protect a moving objective from hordes of respawning enemies, there is absolutely no variety in game modes in this game. The first mode that dropped Tachyon Rifts has proven to just be recycled modes with a timer tacked on. Studio head Scott Amos assures the players across all platforms that people will return when the content drops. But what content? More robot fights? Two archers? Bad skins? Recycled game modes? Nobody cares and any other mentality is willful ignorance among brain-dead morons who think gambling on two archers as first DLC characters in a friggin' superhero game is anything other than insane. People would love to play as THESE heroes, but you're not getting that, and you won't be getting that for inside half a year. 
the best chance that this game had was to limp through to the end of the current generation. And then with the PS5 and the Xbox One X, release a better version with triple the villains, some actual variety in the game modes, more locations, at least two of these heroes, and awesome comic book skins celebrating the 80 year legacy of Marvel. But with them pushing everything further back, they're not just securing disinterest in this bad product, but they're solidifying their legacy as a studio gone wrong that no one would ever in their right mind deal with in the future. We can only hope that they'll be forced to pull a fallout to dig themselves out of a grave and make sure that people will actually want to deal with them in the future. Because right now, you have poisoned yourself. And you'd best be figuring out a new name to call yourselves, because if you slap Crystal Dynamics on a box, most people are going to know better. Some people will defend this game no matter what. And if this studio is dumb enough to cater exclusively to those people, then you will find out firsthand that they are not enough. You need to make an appealing carrot for more than a minority. You need to stop pretending you don't know why players have left and more importantly why they're going to stay gone and you need to stop the madness. Crystal Dynamics, you have a live service lacking social features. You have a looter with bad loot. But the most offensive thing here is truly that this Marvel title has two villains one enemy type and zero marvel locations on offer and if that wasn't bad enough you've screwed up even the microtransactions with bad skins that are afraid of comic books screwing up this badly with a marvel of uh, it might as well be black magic as far as i'm concerned and speaking of black magic i wouldn't expect any large amount of players returning to your game before Black Panther, Scarlet Witch, and Doctor Stranger in this game. Take your time. Here's hoping you can't dig up any more archers to throw out before them, you know what I mean? Anyone who wishes to defend the game in its current state, feel free to embarrass yourself in the comments section below. I will be eagerly reading with popcorn in hand. And uh, if you want to pretend that I'm just a hater, and that's the reason that I guess you know, I wish that the thing that I put forth at the beginning of this video was something that was in the game, by all means, you know what I mean? I, I'm not here to tell you how to think. If you want to go ahead and leave the comment, Oh, actually, there are four villains in the game? You mean that one chick in the robot, you know what I mean? Is everybody in a mecha villain? By that, by that logic, there's thousands of villains in the game. You want to bring up MODOK? In, in the single player mode that you still can't replay, you know? It's funny because this game put all their eggs in that basket and you can't replay the single player mode. How does that taste? And you're defending this game. You'd defend anything. Like you goblin. <laughs> Whenever I see comments that say something like, oh, this game has potential or you just need to give it more time. It's like, that's interesting because the developers didn't give it more time. And now the player base is like, it has them Pikachu facing. That's weird. You would, you would imagine that something that has been released is ready to be judged. But not for some of these uh, lickers, some of these gobblers and suckers. Damn, we had, uh, we, we had November already. We, we, um, it's Thanksgiving time because I'm seeing nothing but gobblers. That's my turkey noise. That's what y'all are like in the comment section. To everybody else, thank you for, uh, for coming around. For for stopping by, for lending me your ear for one of these videos. It's it's starting to put a smile on my face, man. This is where I'm getting my monies back, you know, by uh, not ad revenue on these videos. I don't make a dime, but just the, the, just the smiles, the comedy that is some of these people in the comment section. Ooh, wee. It's like, it's too good to be true. Thank you once again for watching, thank you for liking, and thank you from the bottom of my heart for subscribing when you haven't even been asked to. If you'd be interested in me making a video just picking out some of the most butt-blasted comments from Defenders, let me know, because if I get a kick out of them, you might as well, and I have no problem compiling some of them and then responding to them for you. 
Love you, stay out of trouble, keep your head down, and find an outlet that is fun. You deserve that.